<laughs> Today we're in uh, on Manila Bay with my good friend Martin. He's one of the editors of boating and water sports. He travels all over the Philippines just looking for hot places to go and have fun. So I'm going to let Martin take over and tell you all about the different places you can go in the Philippines for fun. Go ahead, Martin. For fun in the Philippines, you can start in Davao City. In Davao City, you've got the most beautiful water-filled caves. You've got scuba diving. You've got whitewater rafting. And then you've got one of the three major wakeboard parks around the country. If you move north up to Cagayan de Oro, then you've got more scuba diving up there. You can go up to Cebu. If you go into Cebu, you've got sailing, you've got scuba diving, you've got uh, free diving, which is another new sport that's taken off here. You've got water skiing. Um, taking over to Dumaguete, you've got some brilliant scuba diving over there and a little bit of sailing. Take a trip round up through Negros, Iloilo, you've got sailing there. And after Negros, then you want to come up to Puerto Galera in the Mindoro Island. Puerto Galera has possibly the best scuba diving on the planet. It's got deep water, it's got shallow water, it's got small stuff, it's got big stuff. Scuba diving and sailing, it's possibly one of the best sailing destinations in the country. Moving up from Mindoro, then you've got to go to Manila and Subic Bay. Manila, forget it. Nothing really going on here apart from the boat show. This is where the International Boat Show takes place. Everything else goes up to Subic for sailing, for scuba diving, wreck diving. Carry on from Subic Bay up the coast. You can go surfing in Zambales. After Zambales, you go up, right up to the top with sport fishing. World record marlin, world record dorado and wahoo off the north coast in Santa Ana. Come down the coast to Bala and you're surfing again. Further down, you go surfing most of the east coast of Samar Island. Samar Island ends up in Calicoan Island where there is a five kilometer long surf beach. Going down, you get to Chiarago. Chiarago has the world number one left-hand break for surfers. It is so good, I just go there to watch the wave. It's mystical. Further down the coast again, from Mindanao, coming back towards Davao, you have Mati. In Mati, you go skimboarding. You've got the ABC break in Mati. A for the pros, B for the intermediate, and C for the beginners, all in one location. Beautiful surfing. You want to go on land, I mentioned wakeboarding. You can do that in Davao City or Batangas, or you can go to Camarines Sur, three world-class wakeboard parks. And if you then go across to Palawan in the north, you have El Nido. El Nido is magical. What a beautiful place to go kayaking and scuba diving. Then you've got Bazwanga, Koron. If you want the best wreck diving in Asia, you go to Koron. You've got nine Japanese warships that were sunk by the American Air Force on the 24th of September 1944 at different depths. So whether you're a beginner, an intermediate, or a technical diving, you've got everything you want. In fact, in the Philippines, there's so much fun that you've got to do it if you're active boating and water sports. Cheers. So thanks again to, uh, to Martin for all his information. Remember, active boating and water sports, you'll see the website at the bottom of your screen right now. So come on to the Philippines and let's have some fun. Okay, thanks very much, mate.